For the past decade, we've been giving away some of the baddest trucks on the planet. We buy them, we fix them up, and we give them away. And it all started because back in the day, we were making videos. We are doing funny videos, prank videos, putting them on the internet, putting them on YouTube. And you guys were watching them a lot. You really liked them. And one day, Heavy D and I sat down. We're like, we got to do something for these fans, for all these people watching our videos. Why don't we give a truck away? And that, my friends, is when the Built Diesel was born. We started giving away trucks all the time to people who were watching our videos, to loyal fans and customers of our store. We just give them a truck and there is nothing better, absolutely nothing better, than acting like Santa Claus for a day, and building a truck that you know someone probably wasn't gonna build on their own, and just giving it to them. That was by far my favorite part of doing the Built Diesel giveaways, of giving someone a truck of their dreams. Fast forward to today, we've given away 99 trucks. That's a lot of trucks. And it's time for us to close that chapter. It's time for us to do the final Built Diesel. So the Built Diesel 100 will be DPG's last truck giveaway. It's gonna be the best one yet. We're taking and reincarnating one of my favorite trucks of all time from Built Diesel 3. Remember the US 12 out, that beautiful green Dodge, with the flatbed and the stacks coming out the back? I used to spend hours standing on the back of that truck just waving the American flag because that truck captured the American dream for me. That was the truck I think everybody wanted. I knew I wanted it more than anything, and it was probably my favorite truck giveaway. I, I'm, not, I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. It was my favorite truck giveaway. There you go, set it. Well, we're gonna build it again, but with a newer, better truck. We're gonna do the US 24 valve. Built diesel 100, is going to be in a reincarnation of the US 12 oven. It's going to be the best. And you could be the final winner from Diesel Power Gear. It's your own's birthday, by the way. Today? Yeah. Really? You're not telling any of us? No. Does he does have anybody said anything to him yet? Is it your birthday? Huh? Is it your birthday? Uh -huh. Oh, come on, guy. How old are you? How old are you, T? 34. 34, come on, amigo. Okay, 32. 32, yeah. Really? Yeah, turns 32. Okay, well, think how, how old do you think Chris Farley was when he died? 31. 33. 33? Really? Think of that. All his movies and everything, he did all that for 38, 30, 33. I'm still on the way up. I'm still on the way up. You still got this. Oh, uh, you mean? Well, 37, but like, <laughs> it takes longer <laughs> for some people. <laughs> yeah. Yo, yo, yo! Yo, 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 David! What you doing? It's at the shop, man. What are you doing? <laughs> doing circles in front of the shop, like cool tonight. Lucky? I think I just saw the flags pass by. Are you coming in? Yeah. I was gonna come in, but you know I didn't download the app for the new game. <laughs> <so busy. I didn't. laughs> Look, show out the camera. Show out the front. Just keep circling, man. It'll, it'll open. Uh -huh. To get into our shop, you have to have an app. To have the app. You obviously have to download it. He won't download anything onto his phone, so he can't get in the shop right now. He's just out there doing circles, trying to get in. And store girl's just FaceTiming or selfing Diesel driving around instead of opening it for her. I got a secret. By the way, the reason I called you is I have something to show you. So pull in, uh, I've got a gift-ish. <laughs> so Diesel Dave hasn't seen the giveaway truck yet, which can go two ways. Either he'll be super pumped or he'll be questioning uh, the choices we've made. He also hasn't seen this build, so he has no idea what this is for, so. Oh, here he comes. Steven, look who I found. Oh, you Cash. ran away? Oh, Cash, who is it? Hey, uh, does anybody Let's know the scared. login information for the gate? <laughs> I did, I did, I got okay. it. Yeah. Hey, David, I have something to show you, man. What is it? Is that your new cool shirt, Space Station? I've had this shirt for a long time. I like it. I wore this with you the other night to dinner. Well, I still like it. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate that. <laughs> well, here she is, man. She's, uh, what do you think of her? I'm not gonna tell you what she's for yet. I'm just gonna tell you, you know, that we bought a truck. I mean, I see a lot of potential here. Is this the new shop? Like, That's what I like to hear, potential. A lot of I also, I also take truck? that as a low blow because usually when somebody says, it has potential, that means you view it as a very low, low-valued vehicle right now. What do you love more than a Dodge Cummins? 
manual. A manual Dodge Cummins? Yeah. yeah. All right, it's getting better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here's the theory, man. This isn't the side I usually get in, but that's okay. <laughs> test it out, man. Test out the passenger seat. Oh, passenger? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you don't, I'm not. Here, let me, I'll test out the driver's side. If you don't mind. It feels weird to shift from <laughs> the left side. No, that's fine. Just how the Brits do it? <laughs> yeah. So then I would sit here as a passenger and you would drive. It's got right at 100,000 miles, which here's why we did this, okay? By the way, this is the next giveaway truck. I know it's whoa, it's a little different. Greatest part about it. Now I've already looked at it. We can run smokestacks as it is right now with keeping the catalytic converter, keeping the muffler. There's no like DPF. There's none of that junk on here. So we can like kick it old school. Throw smokestacks. On smokestacks like reincarnate the US 12 valve. See to the US. I knew if six, I would seven? say that you would understand where I was going with it. Well, I'm surprised my I even whole... heard you because I'm stuck in memory lane. You know this is like my old white truck I had. I know. I the know. The one that I met my wife in, that I proposed to my wife in. I, listen, my dogs were in the back. I, I can barely hear anybody else talk right that now. That wasn't manual, right? No. See? This, this is this one is up. better. Yeah, you've one up me. Yeah. The kid that owned it owned a trucking company. He was the second owner of it. And you know anything about guys that run trucking companies? They care about their equipment. They do because they need like to that, work. They exactly. So like he took very good care of this. Like very good care of it. And he was the second owner. He knew the original owner. He obviously took good care of it. It's got the obvious wear and tear like right here. The headliner is still completely glued to the ceiling, which means he took very good care of and it. And the dash is together. Yeah, no cracks in that. I mean you got the elbow, the elbow rub, you probably have the keys. That's normal. But yeah, we'll probably change all the interior. I meant the the, the thing on your pocket. Do you slide in and out of your seat? Oh back, yeah, yeah, yeah. Seat. We're we're a little worn there, but we are we are we have We've already ordered seats for it. So listen, 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 listen. Sorry, sorry, go ahead. We're gonna kick it back old school. Okay. Go back to flashback to one of our old builds, the should we, green. Should we flashback right now? <laughs> and you're back. That's what we kind of mimic. But I need your opinion on this, because this is where I'm like, I'm 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 having a hard time. Rider's block. Right. <laughs> <laughs> builder's block. <laughs> builder's block. Do we go U.S. Duramax wheel and tire setup? U.S. Duramax, keep in mind, was much taller. It was. And ran military tires. Mm -hmm. The green one was run in just like 40s. Mm-hmm. With the like difference between, fuel wheels. Are we trying to steal some of Heavy D's military tires out of the back? I kind of need it to be his idea. Okay. I'm kind of like, hey, man. This is what we're doing. What would you think would be a cool wheel and tire setup on there if you were to pick any of your wheels and tires out back? While you're leaning against the stack of his military wheels, like, I don't know which ones we should go with. Kind of like, well, I mean, kind of like these ones now that I'm looking at them. I mean, is, is the military style still a thing? Like, are you even <laughs> part of the military? <laughs> All right, P. Uh, that's where we're going with it. So, right now, this is the plan. We're gonna take this 2006 one ton Ram and first things first, we're deleting the bed. We're getting that old bed out of here so that the boys at Sparks Motors can build a custom flatbed with a custom headache rack and custom stacks that come out of the bag. It's going to be awesome. Then custom hood, grill, bumper, lights, all on the front so that your grill is looking sweet. Then I'm thinking a textured wrap. Preferably military green because that's what color the US 12 valve was, but we'll decide when we get there. This truck is going to be awesome, and the only thing that's going to make it better is the lift, the wheels, the tires we put on. I might even take off the dualies and put on super singles. While you're watching this, why don't you push pause in the comments below? Say, super singles, dualies. Hold on, let me look at these comments. Oh, super single, huh? <laughs> oh, I knew you were a dually guy. I mean, Dooley Girl. I mean, whichever you prefer, whichever one you identify as. And that, my friends, is going to be the US 12 valve reincarnated. Hey, I think that's an awesome build plan. I think it's great, man. And I'm really excited about it, really. Camera's on, camera's off. Camera's on? It doesn't matter. It is on, yeah. But... yeah. I am really excited about this one. Hey, Ron, we're just oh, talking right. about hey, this month's amigo. build. One, <laughs> two, one, three. three. Hey! Tacos? Yeah, Feliz Navidad! Donut stand or wizard stand? 
with well, a sign out. Wizard what sticks. What is a wizard? Donut bars. We're ready to pull this off, man. Don't leave. Nice. Not even. Help, bro. Who was that? Doug? Gee, you psycho. Get carried away, Doug. You want those run through those rings? I'm just looking at like a normal person with hooks. That's what he said the first time, too. I know you heard. <laughs> hey, Cameron, you want to put that hook on that, on that ring? Well, that looks fun on that slide, eh? Is it? Yeah. The moment we've all been waiting for to see if Doug got all the bolts out. Oh, oh, she seems pretty loose. Go Arriba. up. Up. Arriba. Straight up. Hold on. Hold on. Did he do it, ladies and gentlemen? Oh, there's that off. Negative. Mm, you were so close, Doug. Uh, no, not yet, Doug. Come on, let's cut it. You wanna know what's cool about this? Look at this. <laughs> this one looks jump there, is it? Yeah. And that, my friends, is going to be the US 12 valve reincarnated. It's going to be the final diesel powered gear truck giveaway. So, what I want you to do. It's follow along these videos. Follow along while we build this truck into the coolest truck and we give it away. The giveaway is going to go as long as it takes me to build this truck. Good luck, my friends. DeeceParagear.com.